this is Lauren from the Music Blog Yeah, and I'm sitting down with Chris from Coast today. How are you doing? Very good, thank you. Awesome. So, um, you're currently on tour with Bad Sons and Modern Strangers, so how is that treating you guys so far? It's going really well so far. Um, like some of the, the venues have been absolutely incredible, and the reception we've been getting has been really, really good as well. So, yeah, it's been better than we'd expect, I think. Uh, yeah. Really, really um, so, what have been some of the highlights of this tour so far? I know you just started this, so mm -hmm. there might not be many. Um, the, the, I mean, the two shows in LA that we played at the El Rey in LA and then the Observatory in Santa Ana, and they were both sold out shows and they were absolutely. Yeah, the venues are great. To, to start the tour off on those those two shows was absolutely amazing. And it's also been really nice to see those different places that we I, I've never been to America before, so it's, everything's new. Oh, awesome. so, is this your first time in Toronto too? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Great, awesome. I mean, we, we went to Canada, uh, went to Vancouver, mm -hmm. didn't end up playing the show because it was crazy. Yeah, I actually heard about that. Yeah, it was a bit of a bit of a nightmare, so we didn't have a kind of show, so this will be our first Canadian show, which is quite cool. Awesome. So on that note, um, can you compare like audiences in the UK compared to North American audiences? If there are any, is there any like, major differences at all? Yeah, I guess that like, people, one, the fans sort of way outside the venue, like five hours before, which they don't necessarily do in the UK. I don't know if that's I don't know if that's a culture thing or just yeah, whether, like it, thing or, or, or whether or whether it's a bad sense fans thing. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I guess so. Like the, they seem to scream more. The fans seem to. Lots of screaming girls. Like compared compared with like to like London, the crowds there are very static. Here they seem to like get into it more, or at least want to want to get into it more and have fun. Awesome. So is there anything like fun that you guys do on tour just to like waste the time away and stuff? Uh, Loads of it spent in the van, like this tour obviously we're renting a, a van and we're just driving around in it, so there's because of the size of America, there's so many like, long drives, so passing the time away in the van, like, I've literally gone through about four series of uh, Breaking Bad, so that's been that's been my way of passing time, I guess. Um, so last time I remember you guys released your EP, Your Rush of Blood, so congrats on that. Um, you. Can you tell us a bit about the experience recording the EP? Yeah, yeah, it was... Um, I mean, we, we recorded the Russia Blood, we did a, a demo of it uh, in April, and then we, we just decided that we'd improve it because we thought there were elements of it that were, that were worthy of, of uh, having a re-record. And we did it, and it's, it came out like amazingly well. And uh, yeah, like the, the, the process of doing it was, it was kind of different to what, how we'd done it before. Usually we'd go into a studio all as, a, as five members of the band. And, and uh, you know we played like drums, band and bass and that, and that. But this time around, it was sort of like it was only really Liam that was there the entire time. I came, I came late on and did the, the vocals. So it's was, done it in a much more like methodical, methodical way, and it seemed to work for for this EP. And, uh, yeah, I, I gotta say I love the EP. Like all the tracks much. are just amazing. So thank I can't you. wait to hear the show later on. Yeah, we wanted to release something that had, that had like. Each each track was like really impactful, and, uh, and I, th I think I think what's good about it is that they're fairly like the songs are like different, and hopefully like our fans will, will take one of those as being their favourite song off that EP. You know, and, like loads of them will be everyone's favourite. Awesome. So now that Coast has had um, these two EPs under their belt, so um, do you guys have any plans for like a full length album in the Yeah, yeah, definitely. It will be out in, at the end of this year. I think so. Oh, great. I, I don't awesome. I don't know an exact date because mm -hmm. we don't know one yet. Um, but it will be out at the end of the year. We're, we're, when we finish this tour. We've got about a month before we can finish, finish off the album, and then we come back out to Coachella and do a few more. Yeah, that's exciting. Okay. I know Bad Sons is playing as well. So yeah, awesome. so it'd be kind of cool to like see them again in a in a festival setting. Mm -hmm. so. Um, so we love your spin on indie pop, and this EP is like one of our favorites to play. So, um, what bands have you guys been listening to on lately on tour? We we listen to like loads of different music. I mean, in terms of band wise, I get like. We don't actually listen to loads of band music. Or any like artists and stuff that you listen to? Yeah, I, I, I really like Echo and the Bunny Man, but that's like an 80s band, so um, they're like a big influence on me personally. We listen to loads of different like hip hop, we, we listen to a lot of that in the band, especially this tour, we've got like a, a hip hop playlist, which has been, awesome, which has been yeah. going around quite a lot. Um, yeah, loads of different artists, like Reco, ranging from like The Weeknd to Guy from Mujie, Jordan to. To the body, man. Like, it's, it's so bad. Yeah, I actually follow your, um, I think it's the touring playlist that you guys have on oh, Spotify. Yeah. yeah, it's really great. Thank you. Really yeah. So just to finish up this interview, um, what's the best part of being in post? 
the best part about being close is playing live is like the best thing ever. So being out here in America and going to new places and meeting new people is, is the, like the best thing about being in a band here. So, yeah, that's the best thing. Awesome. Live. So I can't wait to see your show tonight. It's sold out in Toronto at the Garrison. So I just want to thank uh, Chris from Coast for being there with us today for this interview. And we'll check you guys later.